Hey there, beautiful family. I wanted to share this to my friends in Japan. <laughs> Konnichiwa gozaimasu. <laughs> we love you guys so much. And uh, we think about you guys often. I love watching your YouTube videos. And uh, you guys just bring us so much joy. You guys have no idea. And someone's outside having a good time. <laughs> let me close this big old window. Uh, I wanted to let you guys know that um, God, God shared this message with me, something that was on my heart, and I really wanted to share this with you, that uh, God has something so beautiful, so bright for Japan. And... He wants you to ask, what is your role in this? My little puppy keeps licking me. He keeps, he, my little Inu, <laughs> he keeps kissing me. His name is Lavi-san or Lavi-chan. <laughs> he loves you guys too. Thank you, Lavi. But uh, anyway, uh, I wanted to share, like, what's your part to play in Japan, what's your role as a believer? And the news, the media, everybody might speak and say the facts of, well, we have an aged population, there's problems with inflation, there's always going to be problems, and there's always some bad news somewhere. But the gospel is good news. And what is the good news that God has for you? And what is your part to play in this? Now, it doesn't mean everybody has to be uh, a pastor or something like that. But ask the Lord, Lord, what do you want me to do? And how do you see Japan? And how should I see Japan? And when you change your perspective on how you see things, it'll totally change your outlook. A friend of mine says, well, it's hard to share the gospel with the Japanese. They're, they're not open. And then another friend says, yeah, but uh, there was a preacher who came through. And we shared the gospel with a thousand people. It was very easy. So it became a matter of perspective. How do we see it? Is it hard or is it easy? Is it impossible? Or is it just because we haven't done it yet? So I believe God has something so beautiful and so bright for Japan and for all the people there. The first thing we can do is start agreeing with God's heart. Start agreeing with his vision and with his plans for that nation. So what is your role to play in that nation? So I think as you come to the Lord and start saying, God, the fact is we have problems, but what is the truth? What do you say? And when you start hearing his heart, then you speak that way. You pray that way. You see life that way. When I was walking around in, in Tokyo, I was looking at everything, and I just saw the buildings and uh, I was hanging out with Yushio, and I said, well, all this is mine. He says, well, how is this yours? And I said, well, the Bible says all that the Father has is mine, and I give it unto you. Well, if the Father has all of this and everything belongs to him, you know the Bible also says that the wealth of the wicked is stored up for you, the righteous? Everything, all of Japan's resources, it's stored up for you. You are his righteous sons. You are his heirs. You are his sons and daughters. He expects you to do something with it. But if you say, I cannot, I don't believe that, that's impossible, that'll never happen, then it doesn't. But it will if you spend time with your father and ask him, Father, how do you see me? How should I see other people? And every time I see how the father sees me, it, it brings so much joy to my heart because he's never angry with me. He's not mad at you. He doesn't think you're late. He doesn't think you're old. He doesn't think you are out of time. He is eternal, and he has so much time, so much ability, so much power, so much wisdom to give you. And your job is just to say, hi, <laughs> yes, <laughs> Mino-san, <laughs> we love you guys, everybody. We love you so much because you have so much value to the Father. You are so beautiful. You are so wonderful. All of you uh, just bring so much joy to us. And we can't wait to see you guys again. And I know that you guys are praying and the Lord will open up a door for us to come and just be helpers of your joy. So God bless you. Matane.